on the feed, so let's get into this tea. We're about to get into Lena goes off after Neek posts family pics. Karma boo done with everyone, blah, blah, blah. So as many of you guys know, King and Lena are out in Thailand right now. Now, King posted a video on his Instagram with a caption that read, one month living in Thailand. So people began to get really upset because King and Lena were out celebrating that they've been in Thailand for a month. Someone states, damn, he ain't seen his kid in a whole month and she wanted him far away from his son. Another person states, over there playing dress up and shit. Go get your son. And the <laughs> comments continued. In words, get a new family and forget they got a whole other son. Another person states, moving a thousand plus miles away from your child is outrageous. Now, Neek and Dwayne posted some photos from Dwayne's birthday event. <laughs> I thought that was so cute. I thought it was. And of course, Kaiser and his son were dressed alike in suits. So people started stating things like, you see how Neek didn't have to call King for an outfit? Very demure. You <laughs> see how the boys are matching for the event? Very adorable. Another person states, see how Kaiser got a matching outfit for the event? Very mindful. Very You demure. see how Kaiser got a suit on and he matching everybody else? Very demure. Very mindful. Very cute. Another person <clears throat> states, Dwayne and his sons. So people have been calling Dwayne step daddy of the year. <laughs> so now after all of these comments were posted, Lena went on to Twitter and stated, People be so pressed and obsessed. She also goes on to say, meanwhile, we're living and enjoying life. She let everyone know that I swear I'm coming back to H Texas, a changed person. So now you guys leave your opinions on that down below, but let's move on to this next topic. I think Lena should just stop responding. People not wrong to look at them like, why the fuck y'all ain't got Kaiser. However, we don't know what's going on in the background. I will say for the summer, Neek said that she wanted Kaiser the other half of the summer. <laughs> if y'all don't remember, they had a whole last conversation about this. I want Kaiser the other half of the summer. He was like, why can't I have him the whole summer? She said, because he be with my mama during the school year. And basically, they going to split it. One thing that I've realized, these men not taking these baby moms to court. So, y'all, we might well get used to it. Topic with Big Boogie. Now, I recently reported that he was spotted out with his ex-girlfriend at his mom's birthday dinner. And it appears that she's also going to be attending an event that he has tonight in Memphis. She reposted the flyer and stated, we outside. Now it seems that Boogie just has a really good relationship with his ex-girlfriend. I'm thinking maybe they came up together. He keeps her around and she's very close to his family, but they're just not together anymore. I mean, he was under Carmen's photo on Instagram commenting, yup, mine. But then a few hours later, he went onto Facebook and stated, only thing getting my time is my daughter in studio. Nothing else matters to me anymore. I'm straight on everything and everybody. It is what it is. So then people started thinking that this had something. I don't see this as an issue either, Kristen. To do with his relationship with Carmen. They were stating, oh child, that woman is still healing. Good luck. It's going to be challenging. Another person states, LOL, this man been making posts after posts like this since he been with old girl. Just get you a country girl like me and call it a day another person states what about carmen so you guys leave your opinions on that down in the comment section below but let's move on to this next topic with Corey and his boo Danny. Now, after Corey mentioned Sherelle, the girl that is exposing Danny for scamming, now Sherelle is coming for Corey too. She stated he's also a scammer. I see why you two together. I see why you two together. But guess what? What they call me? Birds of a feather flock together. Yo. Flock together. Yo. Birds of a feather flock together. Both you bitches going down. Yeah, bitch. I know you scamming. I know you scamming too. See, you should have just sat back and shut the. They didn't. They didn't tell you I was a scammer slayer. This is what I do. I slay the scam. They call Birds. you what? No, Corey and Danny were on Facebook. I think that that's crazy, and she out here making CPNs, not. Since y'all saying it's legal, not the legal way, she's making it the illegal way. Yeah. No, it's no excuse. 
that. I'm, I'm just, how can a scammer call out scammers? <laughs> Live and Danny was debunking <laughs> all of these scam allegations. Corey stated that they're getting ready to go out on vacation and have a baby. Look, what? Know. Why? Oh my God. Didn't, didn't know. So me and Danny, y'all, y'all finna see us on YouTube, all right? I know a lot of y'all no. didn't miss. <laughs> you not a YouTuber? <laughs> no. You go YouTube. No. She always says my phone talks about we need her to stop a YouTube channel. Now you're gonna talk about no. people been sending the Man, do I need to go to my messages? I don't care. Hey, hey, read, go, 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 go to my message. Go, 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 go to my message. Wait, I'm trying to find me somewhere to go. I don't have time for you right now. You don't got time for me? Mm -hmm. You don't got time for me? Get back, Corey. You got time for me, huh? I'm finna get up. I'm, I swear I'm finna, I'm finna d -lo you. Hey, what the fuck you ain't finna d you and chill, bro. Get back. Dubai. Move. Dubai will be nice. You wanna go to Dubai? Yeah. I ain't never been to Dubai yet, though. It will be nice. The dinner in the sky and stuff. It's a lot. Oh, that's hard. Right. How long that flight is? That's like 15 hours to go. how long the flight is. I think it's just leaving from where we are. Oh, they go to Bora Bora. <sighs> they go to Bora Bora. Fuck that. I want to go to Bora Bora, too. I ain't going to hold you. Dubai. Dude. Dubai flight is... I think like six hours, maybe. 22 hours. <laughs> oh, yeah. He talking about six. What? Get off that. I ain't doing it. I'm telling you, I ain't doing it. Yeah, that's a 24-hour flight. I go to Mexico. Yeah, what, what part of Mexico people be going to? Columbia. I, I love Cabo. Cabo. Is it Mexico? Mm -hmm. So what happened to that flight? What you say? What, what, they got no flights there? Hmm? They got no flights to Cabo? No, no, they ain't got no flights to Cabo. I think it's <coughs> Man, look, you, you just try a different fucking... Uh, 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 I don't know, man. Go to United. No. I can't stand this bougie motherfucker sometimes, bro. She all on the fly Delta. I don't get it. Bro, United is I love not... Delta. That's really how we fly, too. Peace. What is it? United wings be shaking. What the fuck they don't? I've been flying United my, like, since I've been flying. It's like one of my... Use my own phone. Let's go. Cancun. Yeah, they go to Cancun. Go there getting drunk and have a baby. Have a baby by me, baby. Yeah, someone look smile. Talking about you again, girl. Girl, she's a scammer. You haven't heard about her. She just look her. Up. She she would be in prison soon. The IRS gonna play her, play with her. Oh wow, Erica, 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 Erica Delay Wilson. You know what? What messes me up with men <clears throat> getting women pregnant after they get the woman pregnant, they don't be attracted to her no more. Like. Some do. Some fall in love over again. But some, they, the woman don't really want to have sex like that no more. Be, you know, they be cheating and, you know, don't like the way your body don't uh, snatch back. And I just think it's so stupid <laughs> that they be wanting to have a baby like that. I don't get it. I really don't. Like, especially when you already have kids. Like, I don't understand that. I really don't. The bitches be hanging so bad, bro. I work with Why females Iris. hate it's so crazy. much, bro. You know what? Let me call my Aries representative while I'm on the phone. Let me call my Aries guy. You got all these kids and hang like that. Let me. I'm finna just ask them. I'm finna call my Aries person. Man, fuck these folks. I just seen them. Hey, like... hey, brother. How you doing? I'm fine, sis. Just walking. How are you? I'm doing uh, great. Brother, listen, he's looking for me and I'm going to be in jail soon. How do you feel about that? I don't agree with that. Like I told you a long time ago, we would have got a letter from uh, Re Refundo. It would have went to the uh, compliance department. In, in seven, eight years, have I ever got a letter from the IRS? No. <clears throat> Since I've been doing taxes. Not with me. What's Refundo? <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay, because it's like that's Corey laughing at you because people. Who's Corey? Your boyfriend? Yeah. Yeah, they they in my comment. Hey, What's up, brother? What's up, brother? Yeah, they in my comment. They talking about she's a scammer. You haven't heard about her? Just look her up. She would be in prison soon. The IRS ain't gonna play with her. She thinks she had gotten away with all the dirty mess she did. I know people right now building a case on her for scamming them for her, their taxes. 
I know building the case right now. People building the case right now is hilarious. Who is people? <laughs> okay, that's what I was about to say. <laughs> Man, I wouldn't worry about it until we get a, a letter. No, nah, we never worry about it. It's just funny how... Federal, from the, yeah, from the Federal Investigation Bureau. They still gonna believe she And, and that's something we ain't never got. So... And we have never received that. Never. 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 Now, have we got complaints on you? Yeah, maybe like four or five a year, but... Yeah. Um, the, the haters gonna call in, but it don't never yeah, stick. Call in. Could, because they so say I they say I deposit people refunds into my now they, 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 this is what they saying. They said I deposit people refunds into my bank account. Uh, <laughs> no, we know that's not true. <laughs> <laughs> that part I really don't believe that shit. <laughs> I'm sorry, but that has to go to the bank in order to do that. <laughs> And I be, and you problem. know some brother, I be really trying to school these people like, how can I deposit a refund into my bank account and my even is connected with to the IRS bank? That's crazy. The lady talks about, get the fuck off. I have family. She has scams. That scam. is crazy. Lady don't know your yeah, fucking family. I'm like, what does they call a scam? Charging a prep fee is not a scam. No, no, it's not. I don't even know why... They keep bringing up the prep fee. Y'all know everything got a fee to it, so I want to see some proof. You can Not call no goddamn made up text messages. Call the bank all day and say, "Danny charged me three hundred, four hundred dollars." This that is my prep fee. Fuck your family. I tell you, I said, fuck all your family. <laughs> Nobody can tell you what you can't charge. Exactly. Like according to the bank, we can charge up to twenty four ninety nine if we wanted to. If you wanted to. So that is all I'm saying. So I'm a scammer because my prep fee is this and that. Like, that don't make me a scammer. And, like, yeah, I ain't nobody finna label that I put somebody's stuff in my bank account. Like, why would I do that anyway? That's the first step in jail. Not literally. I don't, I just, y'all, I know we hear and see a lot of things. But this right here, I just don't believe it. You think well, I'm finna risk everything like I got going on I for a refund in my bank account? Is it uh the people from uh, Memphis? Man, yes, the Memphis people, Mrs. Yeah, let them see, people. Let me see real quick. <laughs> oh yeah, Mississippi. Yeah, she's from Mississippi. <laughs> oh, exact makes... Kruger, Mississippi. She's going hard because Sherelle is going hard on this every day, every fucking day. <laughs> we as that man. This ain't let up yet. So got the right to defend herself, especially if it ain't true. I could see if she came out with something, you know what I'm saying? Got missing, kept it moving. Ah, oh, she on her ass. Country yet? I mean, she, I'm sorry, brother. Is she, is she 32 no, years no, old? No, I wouldn't worry about it. It's, 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 uh, I get a letter, well, it goes to the compliance. And once it goes to compliance, they'll call me and say, hey, Reggie, uh, we're going to have to sh shut Justine down. <laughs> it happened to me once. Since mm -hmm. I've been doing this for 20 years. I'm going to tell, I'm gonna tell you some rice. So it only happened to you yeah. with one of your partners? Yeah, one of my... Uh, one of my I think well, I know which one you're talking four. about. But in eight yeah. years, never got no letter. Not in eight years, no ma'am. Never been shut uh -huh. down. You never been shut down. And, and let's let's confirm. The IRS pay me millions. Millions. So if somebody was getting paying pay millions, do you actually think they'll still be paying me all these prep fees? And I'm a scammer? You're a scammer because here, here's, here's another thing. If you were shut down, your prep fees, people would be looking at you if you was charging like $3,000 or more and doing maybe 200 returns. Exactly. And if I was shut down, I won't even still be getting paid. I, I'm still getting paid every week now for taxes, right? Don't I still get paid every week? Pretty much. Uh, you got you to gotta drop this week? I still get tax drops every week. Tough. If you were a scammer, you wouldn't be getting funded. Can y'all can, can y'all teach me how to uh, do taxes? You joking? Oh, like y'all teach me how to scam? <laughs> <laughs> She's right next to you, brother. <laughs> yeah, I want to learn how to do taxes. Yeah, I want to learn how to do all that. She's right next to you. <laughs> she get paid every week. I, 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 I'm gonna get yeah, that. Yeah, pretty much. It's probably let me see. Tax season like nine, like ten months. I would say maybe July. You don't see anything, and a little bit of August. But after that, September, October. And a little bit in November, you die. Damn. My tax lady. Oh. Man, okay. But February and March is your heavy, your heavy months. That's 
probably 80% of your, your, pre, your tax break fees. Yeah, I'm trying to learn how to do it. I'm going to go to school for it. Danny yeah, going to teach February, me. March. April's a little bit, then it shuts down. May, June, it picks up a little bit in July, a little bit in August, shuts down. Then September, picks right back up. October, a little bit, and then you're done. That's all. But you know what? Since, since, since I've been partnered with you, like since you've been my mentor, we we go through this every year before tax season start. They start that scammer stuff every year, don't they? Pretty much around this time. <laughs> you know what? They starting a little bit early this year because normally it be normally be like October, November. They wait good inside, like just drop my tax class. Oh, she a scammer. Oh, she took my money. Look, I would rather for y'all to say, "Oh, she charged me a fee." Y'all people be wanting stuff for free, and here's my thing, like. If you get somebody more money than what they seven 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 in the trap deserve, then you shouldn't even be complaining about what somebody charged. Yeah, you shouldn't. And you do a little bit extra for your clients that I know of anyway. Exactly. Mm -hmm. You give them you give them extra credits when they don't deserve it. So they yeah, she them. teach you how to do it. Exactly. Uh, she got her own. But class. you know something, you know something. I'm house. really, I'm really about to. I'm gonna just start giving them regular basic refunds, like. Because you should, you should see because it's not even worth it anymore. Just fine. Yeah. You mentor people. You get. I don't. I don't even it. care if I know it's a credit that can help them. I'm still not gonna do it because people are so ungrateful. Like you take people from getting four thousand dollars back to getting eight thousand dollars, and they mad at you because you charged them five six hundred dollars and left them with seventy five hundred when you could have got four thousand dollars. They don't look at that no more. So that's why I'm doing regular basic refunds. It is what it is. Now y'all messing up the church's money. Ooh. Ain't and nothing like your tax lady uh, knowing how to get you there. Fun. You do fun the way you do. You, you, uh, I looked at your report that day. Yeah, 81%. And, you, and, you hooked and, it up. and my funding rates be good every year. Yeah, they be good every and year. And I help people get funded. That, like, if how you still daddy? waiting on your refund, I'm actually reaching man, out to you. That man in Auburn. You. At the game, I'm gonna believe like actually helping you get, get funded. You got people that would do your taxes, and you held up. They won't even help you, but no, they la they no, labor people fact. like me as a scammer. Yeah, and that that is a fact. I, I go through that all like, every year. You got people that just there for three or four months and they out. Damn. Exactly. They in contact with their tax preparer. I said, call your tax preparer. Call your tax preparer. I can't help. You. <laughs> as soon as they get their first drop, you don't hear from that tax preparer. No. Get up and wash up. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go wash up. I'm gonna wash my balls. That is crazy. I'm gonna wash my balls. I wouldn't worry about it, Danny. Sis, sis, just this nigga Corey dug my feather. Balls was crazy. <laughs> Neat. Yeah, no. Get up and wash up. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go wash up. I'm gonna wash my balls. That is crazy. I'm gonna wash my balls. I wouldn't worry about <laughs> it, Danny. Sis, sis, just yeah. they starting early this year, but just do your thing. Because at the end got of the day, the day got to end. How, how many um uh, how many tax potential tax partners we got like uh, waiting on me to call them? I'm gonna send you a list. I'm gonna reset. Where you, where you at? Really, I think personally, you have eight good ones. Like I'm talking about. No, I'm talking about. No, I'm talking about, no, about waiting online for us to they contact them. I can't do that. Oh, hundreds. Oh, yeah, hundreds. You're talking about, have I contact? No, you got hundreds. Oh, yeah, you got like 600 some odd people left. Yeah. Easily. Only, only email blasts with 800. That's yeah. 1,500 leagues in there. I can only. I'm going to massage. Somebody said I need 20 bands back. Somebody said I need 20 bands back. Jasmine Robinson. Go get your hair did before you even comment on here. <laughs> Jasmine, okay, Jasmine Bank Robinson, please you get your hair did. I'm going to call you later once I get food and everything. She look trash. All right, when, when y'all coming back this way? I ain't even read her comment. We trying to see now. Probably today. Okay. Yeah. Right, okay, bye-bye. Yeah, tell Jasmine, Jasmine, go get your fucking hair did before Forking. you get on here and say anything. Somebody abused the fuck out your head. That man clearly said you gave away holiday loans to 2,000 clients. That's hard. Come on, let's get, get, get ready. Come on, let's get up. Uh, 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 no, don't get up just yet. I'm, 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 I'm in line first real quick. All right, bye, y'all. I'm going to go. What? Uh, uh, no, don't get up just yet. I'm, 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 I'm in line first real quick. All right, bye, y'all. I'm going to go. I'm going to what? I'm going to ask you what I'm What? <laughs>
Y'all let me know what y'all thinking in the comment section below, girl. I'm done with this video. <laughs> y'all. Love y'all. Appreciate y'all. Hell yeah.